I just received the Atmo tube from Indiegogo. It was an Indiegogo campaign. I funded it a while back. Finally received it. This is the exterior casing that it came in. Well, it came in a box and this is what's inside. Moving that. And this Atmo tube is supposed to detect air quality. It has like sensors and I think it connects to your iPhone or Android app. So let's see what we got in here. Okay, there it is. Oh, so it's it's got like a little thin metal feel to it. Okay, there's the I guess that's the part that takes in the air. It's got a USB charging port. I guess you could hold it like that. Even has like the Apple kind of writing. Yeah. Came with this little Atmo tube, I guess, startup manual. And here's the USB charging cable. This cord seems to be a proprietary cable. It looks like a micro USB, but it's it the shape of it is not the same. So that's interesting. It was a good project to back. I wanted to get it because when I saw the movie Mission to Mars in like 1996, the astronauts had this like atmosphere detector and I always wanted something like that. And so I finally have it. It's not quite where it needs to be at for what I want it for, but it's a good, it's a good start and I think it'll be improved upon. I'd like it to be a little bit more granular and accurate and more reporting, more granular reporting. I, I had someone blow cigar smoke into the sensors and it the, the, the air quality went down. Most of the time I had like 88 to 90 for my air quality, which was good. Sometimes it would be 97. I even put it in my uh, washroom and I thought the bleach and everything would make it poison, but it turned out okay. The 67 is from when we blew the cigar smoke in it, 68. And then it like does an average, so it took a while for it to go back to normal. And uh, I did like a firmware update on it. Uh, all in all, it's cool, but I, I like to see it improved. One of the things that I wanted it to do is have the display on the device itself. I feel like I have to use my iPhone and leave it connected to the Atmo tube. I might be doing it wrong, but it, it feels like it requires too much resources for my phone. I wish it had its own readout on the device itself. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you want to get one, if there's a link, I'll put it in the description.